smaller tank allows the rider to sit further forward and as a result the 2016 Speed Triple feels much sportier steering than before. The chassis, swing arm and geometry remain unchanged. So too does the RS fully adjustable Olin's Nix 30 front fork and TTX rear shock. The ride is composed and precise but could be a little too stiff for badly surfaced UK roads. With the softer shower suspended S model perhaps offering a more comfortable road option, like the S. The Speed Triple R features gorgeous Brembo M4 monoblock front brake calipers reinforced by switchable ABS which offer plenty of stopping power and a fairly sharp initial bite. It makes a smidge more power, up from 133 bhp to 138 bhp, than the previous model. And top spin boosted by an average of 5 FTLB right across the rev range, but it's in the low and mid range where the changes are most noticeable. Assisted by the new ride-by-wire throttle system, the initial twist of the wrist rewards with instant urgent response meaning that below 3500 revolutions per minute the new speed triple feels much more aggressive than the previous model. Yet despite that snappy pickup, the new triple has a beautiful air of sophistication and refinement in its power delivery, allowing you to get swept along on the swell of mid-range courtesy of an engine that's keen as English mustard to rev, for all its newfound silkiness. Triumph have lost none of the Speed Triple's rotty character, it's still bold and mechanical, and the new, free of flowing and lighter.